Hey guys, welcome back to Tomorrow Rule 16. I am your host Javon, and today we're about for a brand new benchmark. We're going to Cyberpunk 2077, the Phantom Liberty update for the PC. Today I'm running this on my Intel Core i3-10105 with the AMD RX 570 4GB VRAM graphics card. I'm running with 32GB of DDR4 RAM and dual channel memory. What are you looking at? That's what I thought. And today we're running the game on the 1080p on the low preset I've, I've gone with so far. I feel like that's probably for the best. We're doing the low preset with FSR 2.1 on quality. We're going to hope for the, the best here at the time. I have textures set to medium, texture quality set to medium, and we're going to see what happens. I'm going to uncap the frame rate real quick. My temps are probably going to be ridiculous, but why not, right? I'm just going to steal this car. Just just, just, just chill. Just, just hold for me one minute, bro. Big bro, okay? I got you, big bro. I got you. Thank you. Oh, wait. I can start a fight over there. Right off the bat. So... It seems like it is playable like this, but like I said, Dogtown can get demanding. It really can. Like, that's not a joke. This game gets really demanding when it need, wants to be. I'm going to shoot you in the face now. I'm also going to... Oh, wow, you just... You, you kind of just took that ten toes, huh? Good. That went well. I thought I thought that went well. Did, did don't you guys? So combat seems to you know, even though the specs seem to be ridiculous for this game, it does seem like it runs fine. All things considered, what what it, you were the only enemy here? Okay, no, they're over here too. Nice, ten toes up in here. Okay, he just took it. I was like, bro, why you hit me for a shotgun to my face? So why'd that guy go down? I felt like that guy would have survived more than this guy. That's crazy. Regardless, let's move on with our day now. Driving obviously will be more demanding than running around. Driving is... Driving can be rough sometimes in, in Dogtown. There's a lot of clutter going, around, going on here. There's a lot of stuff happening in this game. Which I can, I can definitely... Oh, come on, again? <laughs> I flipped it over in the Vega video too. So we're using 9.4 gigabytes of RAM and 2.7 of VRAM. That's nice because it means I could have probably carried the texture quality up to high. Kind of regretting that now, but you know, it is what it is. Better safe than sorry. But the game does seem to run fine. Until I, and I, I, this area is quite, look at this area. It gets worse though. The foliage makes it a lot worse in a second. This is a 30 FPS experience is what I would like to say. This is definitely a 30 FPS experience. Nowadays, it, it's just, it's been way too, it's way too demanding now. Oh my gosh. I can't, st oh wait, nope, nope, no. Nope. I saw that guy with a robot. I ain't, nope, 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 nope. I was going to engage, then I saw the robot, and I said, nah, I ain't, I ain't engaging in a, in a damn thing. Oh, wait. Look at these guys over here. Stand ten toes, my boys. Stand ten toes. Maybe I should go for this guy. He looks bigger. Man, these guys really just be taking shotgun shells to the face. Like, it's all good, brother. I'm like, is it? I was wondering who said that. Who said, who's shooting me? Someone just shot me. Ow. Oh, there you are. Where, where did you come from? Oh, wow. Wait, holy crap. Was this, was there a... Oh, no. I've made an error in judgment. This guy's way too far. I need to, I need to, to crown in on you. You're way too far away. You're still alive, actually. Not anymore, you aren't. Let me get them legs, let me get them ankles, let me get them ankles. The game is playing well. Still looks decent as well, even on low. This game looks really good. I don't see... Okay, that guy's clipping through the car. That's awkward for everybody. Nice. So it seems to be staying around the 40 FPS average, which is quite nice to me. Honestly, better than I expected it to. Like I said, Dog Tongue is way more demanding than the original game. It just is. This area has so much more clutter and stuff going on. 
Like it really will get you. I'm, I'm here. You just told me to come on. I came on, man. And I shot you in the face. That happened. I mean. But once again, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Don't forget to please leave a like, comment, share, subscribe, and stick around for more epic content. I know you guys love seeing the RX 570 as it was the first actual GPU I used to, used to test on the setup here. So I needed to make sure I get this put out for you guys. But look, I feel like here is where it gets really demanding. Yep, here is very demanding. You see, there's so much clutter going on. It makes sense that it would it would stutter like this. It does make sense. Not saying it doesn't. I just ran over that guy. And it's like, I don't even want, I feel like putting it any lower. Nah, you guys got a turret. Y'all can, y'all can chill. I remember y'all got turrets, bro. Who the heck are you? Obviously, I'm not going to where I'm supposed to go. Clearly, because this is a benchmark. But yeah, there's so much going on here. It's like, when I see all of this, it's like, whoa. There's too much stuff. Hi, guys. How, hi, random citizens. I'm about to ruin your day for. Well, that happened. Who's... What's that noise? Why do I hear... Weird. I feel like I heard something. I, I, I feel I should be more ready to respond to it, but I, I'm not. So I'll just move. I'll just move on with my day. Oh, look. There they are. Hey, guys. What's going on? How do I get up there real quick so I can shoot you in the face? We risking it all for the biscuit, bro. We risking it. Oh, wow. You kind of just stamped. Didn't expect that. Oh, come on, I jumped. Oh, no. Don't get, don't get geometry stuck on walls. Anyway, this is your Cyberpunk 2077, the Phantom Liberty update. It runs like butter. There's no stutter or anything. I'd say that that is a win in itself. Wouldn't you... This is 1080p low, FSR quality. We are able to get over a stable 30 FPS. I love it. For the sake of the video though, because I'm about to end the video, I actually will try to go down one more. Just one more tier. Let's go down to balance. In fact, let's see what performance has to offer. Not much more, to be honest with you. Because at some point, I feel like my CPU just can't... Yeah, at some point, my CPU just can't push the frames anymore. So 1080p quality, probably your best bet here. And I'll see you guys next time.